Hello everyone and welcome back and this will be your general weekly reading for the sign of Virgo for the week of September 15th. And a very special thank you goes out to each and every one of you who have been subscribing to my channel and helping it grow and getting it noticed and sharing with others. And for all the thumbs up on all the videos that you've watched and the lovely comments. Thank you so very much for doing that for me. <coughs> And this week, I am using the Witch's Tarot, which was a gift to me from my daughter. And so I'm changing it up. And along with the uh, uh, Fairy Oracle cards. They're probably tarot cards, but just as a clarifier. All right. And your first card out. The temptress. So, things are starting to come together to you. You're starting to um, understand where you belong. Accepting people for who they are and yourself as well. Your health is starting to return for many of you. You're starting to feel in a better frame of mind. You have you're more at peace with yourself this week than you probably have been in quite a while. Understanding what it is that your next step is going forward for yourself. This is sort of like an awakening. And the karmic. So something is going to happen around you to somebody that has needing their karma dealt back to them maybe this was something had been done to you and now the cosmos is opening up and and dishing it back out to somebody else or this could be good karma coming in for yourself as well you know maybe you're finally getting some answers to something that you had wanted in the past and now you're understanding what it is you're doing why you're doing it and how it's coming about so it's going to be a good goal for you. And the Ace of Pentacles. So look at that. Money coming in. Wish fulfillment. This is your yes card from the universe. You know, you planted that seed. It's starting to take root and take off. And it's going to have material gains for you. Very quickly. You know, it's going to be... Um, a pay raise for many of you. This could be a lottery win. But there's definitely money on the table here coming in for you. And a significant amount. So that's always nice to see that the universe is finally starting to recognize that one of your wishes are to have more abundance in your life. And the Knight of Wands. So there you go. Making plans for future trips for many of you. Taking a vacation somewhere could be by uh, vehicle. It doesn't necessarily have to be, you know, by airplane or anything like that. It could be just a short trip that you decided to take a gander at something that you had always wanted to see near your own home, but have never, you know, done, gone and explored it, that sort of thing. So there's definitely a trip here, an active trip for you. So you could be taking a walk in the forest, that sort of thing, if you have so much luxury as to be living by that. And the Eight of Pentacles, so there you are, hard at work, mastering your craft, understanding that all the hard work that you have put into something is paying off. You know, and it comes naturally to you because it's a it's an interest of what you want. Now, this could be you taking a course of study for to higher educate yourself in a field that you are, um, like I said, interested in. Oh, and the wheel of fortune. Very nice. Nice to see that come in. So there is definitely money windfall for many of you is coming in. Unexpected money. Uh, this could be a pay raise. You know, your job finally realizing what an asset that you are and 
They're trying to utilize you by offering you more temptation for money. This is your bank account definitely growing. And uh, that career break, maybe you've been doing something on the side hustle and you're finally not only getting recognized for it, but an offer to be paid for your services which is really good because it is going to pay you more than you know if you have a steady nine to five job now this new endeavor that you're going to undertake is going to pay you way more for less work for your efforts in the future and the six of cups and they're gonna go down the nostalgic road a little bit and that's all right sometimes it's nice to you know just think back to when you were a child i remember i got asked <clears throat> when myself was younger what it is I wanted to do when when I got older and it's kind of funny how close you come to you know being that something that you had said never never realizing so it, it's a happy memory time for yourself just looking back at things that you wanted to accomplish achieve and go forward on and are doing so with quite ease you know and it's it's going to be a very happy memory for yourself. And the Page of Wands. Yeah, there you go. Definitely have trips in your future. This is a message coming in for some of you. For, for, um, from, I should say, a very long distance. Now, this could be to do with work. You know, maybe you're being offered a new job somewhere else and you're very tempted to take it. But you will definitely look into this. Or this could be some gossip that you've heard um, going on around you that you weren't really aware of. And now you, you know, it's not going to change anything in your life, but it's it's a sort of a heads up for yourself. So to make you aware of what's coming in. And the Ace of Wands. So you definitely got that spark back for yourself. You know, and you're, and you're determined now to let slide out with the old and begin with the new. So that's very nice to see for many of you. This is a new career that is really going to take root and just take off. You know, this is your opportunity. You know, the gods and the doors are knocking and opening for you and you're stepping through and grabbing it with both hands. This new career project that you're getting off the ground is really going to pay you optimum in your sense of being, all of it, money. And you're going to be so happy because this is your, like I said, your spark of inspiration that is going to move you into the next evolution of your life. And the Four of Cups. That's all right. You know, you're just taking a time out for yourself, looking at all that you've accomplished, what you have in your life, and asking yourself the question, am I content enough to stay put where I am? Or is there more that I want? And, of course, there's more that you want, and you will continue to, you know, allow the world to fill up your cups and overflow and... Be happy where you're going because it's going to flow into you quite easily this week. And the Six of Pentacles. And you're very giving and sharing. But you're learning now. You've learned over the last years that it's okay to help others. But it's nice to see them help themselves or offer back to you. And if they're breadcrumbing you and not offering you and helping you, then you're done with them and and that's okay to do that too because sometimes you need to just you know cut that part off and the high priestess yeah you're understanding now of your own true unlimited potential moving forward the doors are starting to open for you you're starting to feel more empowered in your circumstances and your situations you know, your family starting to come together. You're hearing from family members you haven't heard from for many of you in quite some time. And, you know, you're practicing what you preach. You know, you're helping your, your family grow and maintain the future. 
Ooh, and look at that. The Ten of Cups, and there it is. Wish fulfillment. Happy home, happy life. You're so happy with your outcome moving forward that, you know, you want to share with everybody. You, you get along with your co-workers. You get along with, you know, your friends, your relatives, your immediate family, your children. You're just in love with love in life itself, which in turn will pay you back tenfold. All right, I'm going to shuffle and deal you a fairy card. But yours are all about growth and harmony and money coming in and that new career break that you've been wanting for some time. And here it comes, you know, which is lovely to see for you. Time to take action. The power of creativity, success that allows for a life of luxury. Oh, isn't that beautiful? And on that note, I will say goodbye for now. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will talk to you again next week. Bye for now.